this is good one. welcome to today's our class so in our today's class we have to be discuss about the missing order previously we have discussed about the fraud hopper diffraction at double slit experiment in the fraud hopper double slit experiment on that screen we can observe the combination of the interference pattern and due to the uh, due to the two slits and also the diffracted rays due to the secondary wave layers at the slits okay so now our concept is missing order so what is missing order missing order means so there we have derived five conditions in the front of a diffraction at a double slit experiment so what what are those is in the diffraction pattern that due to the diffraction so we have to get the maximum intensity that is that is also called as principal maxima or central maxima from that we can observe the say uh, maxima and minimum intensities like this the intensities will be varies like this this is called as central maxima this is called as minima these are called as minimas or minimum okay these are called as secondary maxima and third so on like that okay this is the entropy uh, sorry diffraction pattern okay so same like then if we take that the interference pattern the interference pattern how we got is so all the bright fringes are having the maximum and also same intensity all the dark fringes are having the zero intensity like this we got the intensity distribution curve previously i have told that is suppose if we take this one so this is a screen okay if we fit into this one okay in between those two we may miss some of the orders some of the interference orders we will miss why because in the finally the uh, previous topic the intensity distribution curves how we got is like this is it or not yes like that we got now our concept is uh, what are the this is the zero this is the primary the, uh, uh, this is the uh, secondary this is the third fine so like that so in this uh, some orders are there so directly zero order first order second order third order like that we will get here also we got the path reference condition and we have finally generalized the condition there also we have used some m or n like that those are also indicates that order those are also indicates that order okay now i will i will show you what are the orders we are going to be miss in the front hopper the double slit experiment so the condition for minima the condition for minima due to the diffraction pattern is what we got previously is a sin theta equals to plus or minus m lambda a sin theta equals to plus or minus m lambda where a is the slit width theta is the angle of diffraction and where m equals to where m equals to 1 2 3 so on these are all orders this is the condition for diffraction minima diffraction minima condition this is the condition we got previously that is diffraction minima okay second one what we have to take is maxima condition for the interference so maxima condition for the interference means constructive interference what is that constructive interference so uh, maxima intensity maximum intensity condition maximum intensity condition condition due to due to interference is due to interference due to interference is what we got a plus b into sin theta equals to a plus b into sin theta equals to plus or minus n lambda where where n equals to 0 1 2 3 so on this is the condition for maximum due to the interference why interference takes place there we have taken two slits it acts like a S1 and it acts like a S2. Two coherent sources, two sources. 
these are acts like a coherent sources due to that superposition we can observe the interference pattern on the screen once again i am recalling you in the fraunhofer double slit experiment in the absence of one slit we can get due to the second slit due to the second slit we can get the diffraction pattern if both the slits are present we will get the diffraction pattern due to the secondary wavelets diffracted at the slits and the interference pattern due to the superposition of the two waves okay now what are the condition uh, sorry what are the uh, orders we are going to be missed so that means regarding that one we have to be take these two equations if we those if, if we take these two equations a plus b into sin theta by a sin theta equals to a sin theta equals to plus or minus n lambda by plus or minus m lambda n n sorry lambda lambda cancel sin theta sin theta cancel that implies a plus b by a equals to n by m this is the condition this is the condition for the missing order now we will see suppose here a is the width of the each slit b is the separation between the two successive slits separation between the two successive slits for example here we have to take one case the first case is the case one is case one case one is if width of the slit width of the slit is equals to the opaque barrier if width of the slit is equals to the opaque barrier if a equals to b if a equals to b means a plus a a plus a means 2a by a equals to n by m n by m a a cancel so that implies n n equals to 2m n equals to 2m suppose if you substitute m equals to 1 2 3 so on what will happen so in the n equals to in, in the place of m we have to take 1 1 into uh, so 2 into 1 2 in the place of m if we take substitute 2 2 2 are 4 3 2 are 6 so on that means if the width of this slit is equals to the opaque barrier then then the in the interference second fourth sixth address are missing for example if case 2 in the case 2 what we have to take is if a equals to if a equals to to your uh, to b or b equals to 2a so if b equals to 2a if b equals to 2a b equals to 2a then what we what what are the orders we are going to be missing here is b equals to what is the equation we got here so b a plus b that means a plus 2a that is 3a that equals to m by m if n and cancel sorry a a cancel n equals to 3m suppose if the order of the direction is m equals to 1 then the interference pattern third order will be missing suppose if m equals to 2 3 2 are 6 the sixth order will be missing if m equals to 3 3 3 are 9 so like this so on these are the diffraction <coughs> interference patterns we are going to be miss please subscribe to my channel thank you